Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Jorge. Good evening, Nelson. Hello, Suleyma and Olga. Can you, can you hear me, Suleyma, Olga? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. I'm here. Oh, good, good. Welcome. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Oh, good. Excellent. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. Excellent, excellent. Okay, hello, um, Karina. Karina, are you there? Oh, she's still connecting her audio. Okay, all right. Welcome, and thank you for connecting on time. Um, how was your week? We finished, right? We're finished the, the end of the week, <laughs> right? Are we, uh, what do you have to work that. tomorrow? No. no. No, you have to work tomorrow? No. Good, good, good. Okay. It's Monday to Friday. Good, excellent. Is enough? Yeah, oh, absolutely. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> okay. Um, and you, Olga, do you work tomorrow? Can you hear me? I have, yes, teacher. I have incapacity for mine. Oh, okay. You, you have a sick leave. Yes. A sick leave. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are you feeling better or are you not so good? Uh, I'm feeling better. Yes. Good. Thank you. Good, good, good. Okay. All right. But normally you work Saturdays. Yes, I work Saturday, mm. but not tomorrow tomorrow okay yeah you need to rest for tomorrow that's for sure you need to rest yeah i know it's hard <laughs> it's very hard but okay hello miguel hello teacher how are you good how are you that's fine. Very good. I'm glad to hear that. Um, and uh, are, you, are you going to be working tomorrow as well? Or today was finished? Miguel? I'm sorry, teach. Oh, it's okay. I was just asking, are you going to be finished tomorrow? Um, sorry, are you going to be finished? Uh, better said, are you finished working all this week or do you have to work tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow uh, at 12 p.m. 12 p.m.? Yes. Wow, okay, so four hours? So four hours. Four hours, okay. I see, I see, okay. All right, well, um, well, you know, four hours, it goes quickly, right? That's the good thing. It goes by quickly, right? Okay. Okay, class. Uh, well, I think I'm going to start with our attendance. Um, and if you guys can help me with the cameras, that'd be wonderful. Okay, just a second. 
Perfecto. Chicos, si pueden ayudarme con sus camaritas, les agradecería mucho. Ok. Ok. Just a second, que sepan. My, my computer is thinking. Mm -hmm. It likes to think. Okay. You need, you need a take a new one. Uh, and I, no, I I think what I need is to um to you know clean with the antivirus. Mm -hmm. I think that's what I need. Or increase the memory. Mm, it has quite a bit. It has um it has quite a bit of memory. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um all right, here we go. Let's check. Uh Cristina. Okay, welcome Cristina. Uh Annie. Annie? No, no, Ani. Mari. Mari. Sorry. No, okay. Carolina. Carolina. No, Carolina. Eh, Christy. Casey. Okay, Jorge. Present teacher. All right, wonderful. Welcome. Karen. Karen. Karina. Present. Welcome. Leonardo. Leonardo. Linda? Linda? No. Uh, Marlene? Marlene? Okay. Uh, Miguel? So, uh, Hello, Miguel. Can you hear me well? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it's just your, it sounds very good, but I can hear you. Uh, Nelson G. Present teacher. Wonderful, Nelson A. Present teacher. Wonderful, welcome. Norma. Present teacher. Okay, welcome, Norma. And Olga. Olga. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Omar. Omar. And Suleima Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay. Are, are you having problems with the camera? Uh, yes, teacher. En un momento entro con la cámara. Ah, okay. Yes. Uh, Suleima Melgar. And Tatiana. Tatiana? No. Okay. But, oh, a montón que no escuché. Okay. Let me, let me say again the people that I didn't hear. I didn't hear Annie, Mari. Present teacher. Ah. Annie. <laughs> okay, welcome, Ani. So we have uh, Mari, Carolina, Christy, Karen, Leonardo, Linda, Marlene, Omar, and Suleima Melgar, and Tatiana. Those are the people I didn't hear. And did I miss anybody? 
No? Okay. No, sure. Okay. All right. In that case, uh, we are going to um, start the present the PowerPoint presentation. Please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. Oh, hold on. Mm, give me a huh? We can see it. Okay. You can see it? Yes, teacher. Okay, wonderful. Good. So we have a testing new products conversation. Your teacher is, or your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. It's the intermediate two. It's class number nine. So the first thing is that remember that we were looking at this vocabulary and we were trying to figure out what um, each test was about. So I'm going to send you back to the groups that you were in yesterday. And um, how much more time do you think you need? Five minutes, 10 minutes? How much time? I think five minutes. Five minutes? Yes. Do you all agree five minutes? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yeah, everybody says five minutes. Or 10 minutes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Sorry? Could be, could be 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Five minutes or 10 minutes? Class? Five minutes or 10 minutes? Class? I just have one person's opinion, so I want to hear everybody else. So one, sorry, five minutes or 10 minutes? Hello. Chicos? Hello, chicos. Me escuchan. Yes, teacher. Okay. If, if yeah. you want, we can start with five minutes and and if something happened, maybe the other five minutes. Uh huh. Okay. So you think in five minutes and I'm, okay, I'm gonna do it in then in five minutes. Say five minutes too. Okay. Good. Thank. Thank you. I I want to have opinions, right? So that's important. Um, so I'm going to put you into the groups right now that you were in yesterday, same groups as yesterday. So um, give me a moment. Okay. Just a second. I'm going to see who was in, in which group. Okay. So um, we had four groups. In the first group, we had Cristina and Jorge and Nelson and Olga. In group number two, I had uh, Annie, Marlene, but Marlene's not here. Uh, Nelson G. Oh, wait a sec. Give me a moment.
Okay. Um, okay, and, and uh, Norma. Okay, so that's the group number two. Group number three would be Carolina, Miguel, and Silvia Rodriguez. In group number four, we have uh, Mari, which is not who is not here. Christy is not here either. Leonardo is not here. And Linda, oh, is she, Linda is la única del grupo. Okay. Um, oh, I think Mari just came in. She's. Um, on. Okay, so Mari. Hmm? Good evening. Good evening. Okay, I'm going to add. I'm going to add Garden and Karina to group number four, and in group number three, I'm going to add Omar. Okay. Okay. All right. Any questions? No? Okay, so I'm gonna give you five minutes and we'll see how it goes. And if you need more time, we'll, we'll figure it out, okay? So here it goes. Okay. Uh, Cristina, are you there? Cristina, are you there? Cristina, are you there? Do, do you think the concept is is the best the best concept? I think the concept is correct. We is accord to the question. Yeah. Okay. Uh, where is the concept? The concept. Mm, um, that Christina sent in the chat. But there is there is an, uh, a chat. The chat is new. Christina, I don't know if you have the concept. Uy, que salió. Mm. Well, yo, but, but if I, I have the concept in, but, uh, I, I take the screenshot. Let me see. But if, but, okay.
site and handling test and use test. Cristina, do you have the concept? But if if she if she don't have the the concept, why uh, we can speak about what we think? For example, what do you think about the the site and handling test? Just to, to to sell one idea. I think yesterday uh, I have the concept and the explain the number one. Solo nos falta el test número dos. Busquemos el número dos porque si no no vamos a terminar. Voy a escribir en el chat el concepto que mandó. Ana ayer sobre el test número uno. Ok. Use test. Está bien, mal mi señal me está sacando la guerra. No profundizar. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, um, Is this referring solo al, al monadic method? No, it's, it's continuation. Uh, the sequential monadic method is continuation, is uh, promote uh, the product in, in the marketing. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the forms. Yeah. Okay. Um, es que yo encontré lo mismo que usted tiene también, uh -huh. pero eh, yo lo encontré como el monadic método, method, método, ¿cómo se dice? Met uh -huh. Method. Yes. Method. Ah, okay. Thank you. Method. Okay. Entonces, prácticamente, lo que no había averiguado yo es lo del secuencial, secuencial, monadic method. Method. Ese sí me falta a mí, a mí ya. Pero vamos a ver. Ahorita. Consulta acá. Un segundo. Okay. ¿Y yo un deseo, Omar? ¿Eh? Omar. Hello. Este... Ok, yo estoy a grande hilo, gente. Entiendo que esto fue el día de ayer, ¿verdad? Que... Yep. Ok, les voy a leer lo que he encontrado sobre a Sequencer Monadic Refers. Es. Dicen. Ya le di. Is market research told that helps determine consumer preference 
for one or more alternatives or different brands of a product. Yes. Uh, uh, and the consumer. Ese es Branden's test. Branden. Mm, Branden's test. Oh, okay. Yes. And in, in marketing, in marketing, a uh, blind test is often used as a tool for companies to compare. Uh -huh. Eso se puede agregar. Consumer preference for a product's best basis of is. The definition is, is a tool to evaluate the performance of the product. El, uh, the number one, the number two. The number two. Okay. okay. You can send the definition in the chat. Okay. I I send the the definition in the chat. Okay. Um okay. We have to think in in an uh, explain about this. Okay. Uh, sorry. Nelson está ahí. Nelson, are you there? Your question. Sí. Sí. Entonces, de, de nosotras tres, vamos recién ingresando a clases, entonces... Solo estamos uh, medio trabajando en base a lo que Ana Marisol nos ha dicho, que era que ayer estuvieron investigando sobre el tema. Uh -huh. La pregunta es, a nosotros nos toca el grupo 4, porque ahorita somos el grupo 4, digamos, en el, o el 7 que ella tenía cuando ella estuvo ayer. Sí, es el número 7. Ok. Uh -huh. Teacher, ¿sol, ¿solo es investigar? Sí, yeah, eso el concepto. But try try to try to tell me in English. Yes, it's only it's only for uh, for investigating. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I'll see you. So, do you need more time? Uh, yes, teacher. Okay. Are yes. you Okay. Uh, okay. Aquí voy a intentar. Todos somos nosotras tres. Ok, ahorita. ¿Cómo puedo...? poner una, una fotografía de, 
de mi teléfono a, para compartirlos con ustedes, chicas. ¿O no se puede? Creo que no está habilitada la opción. Give me a moment, I'll, I'll do that. Can you, can you share now? No. Can you share? I think no, yes, teacher. Okay. I compare. Share a screen. Compartir pantalla. Ahí abajito. Ah, aquí. Uh -huh. Ajá, pero yo les quería la foto, entonces. Ajá, y como es en el teléfono, se va a ver toda la pantalla. Y ahí se se ve el o sea, no se puede elegir cuál, cuál, cuál pantalla. Ajá. Días antes. ¿Y hoy? Sí. Sí. Ok, yes. pero ¿cómo hago? Um, para dejarla ahí. Si sí, no, mejor voy a compartirla ya, así que deje de compartir. Ok, ahorita. En, en el que, en el Ah, ok, sí, sí, ya lo tengo, lo primero. Ya se ve. Ahí está. Pues estamos aquí. Ajá. Bueno, pero, uy, no voy a agrandar porque no se ve nada. Como prueba, ¿no? So, um, Peter Comparison Test is... Sí, ajá. Are you finished? Almost, teacher. Almost. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I, I think. Can. I think. One minute, please. Oh, no problem. Give me. Give us a minute, please. Okay. But why is everybody so quiet? Uh, because I'm writing my explanation of the of the one of the method. Ah, okay. In the chat. Ah, okay, okay, got it. And what is the test marking? Marketing, no? Test marketing, the test brand, or <clears throat> brand of world customers. Brand perception. Uh, what is the test marketing, no? No, 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 no. No, brand test. 
So brown sort of text. This is a market resource tool that helps determine consumer preference. Ya termino. Ah, oh, no. Ah, oh, no. Are you ready, girls? No, please. <laughs> no? No. How much more time do you need? Um, five minutes. Five minutes, I <laughs> do. Um, es, es, un concepto, dicho, es que un concepto está bien difícil de, de encontrar, la verdad. Mm -hmm. Solo un, una pequeña reseña hemos hecho. Ok. Ok. No, I don't have a problem. It's just, uh -huh. it's that you told me originally five minutes. And now, and now it's like, like it's been like 20 minutes. Ok, no problem. Well, we'll keep waiting. Blanking with cultures. Sí, de brantes no hay mucho, Lina. No. Ponemos solo un ejemplo, creo yo. Uh -huh. Ya si nos preguntan, eh, igual, ¿verdad? Cualquiera contesta la primera y ya, ya sea Omar o, o usted o yo contestamos la siguiente. ¿Are you guys finished? Yes, teacher, finish. Yes? You ready? Yeah. Okay. All right. Great. I'll see you in the main room in a moment. No, teach Right now. The thing is that um, the other groups have asked me a little bit more time, so I'm going to give them about two more minutes. Okay. La evaluación en investigación. Ah, uh, ok. Uh -huh. mm. Products, what can evaluate our wallet, clothing, things. Hmm? Only that, I think. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, girls, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Thank you. I'll see you in the main room in a moment. Okay. Entonces.
You guys are ready? Yes, teacher, estamos solo haciendo la presentación. Ya tenemos los conceptos. Okay. All right. Um, okay, I'll see you in the main room in a moment. Okay. Uh, Ahora, chicos, mientras... Let me share the this the presentation can you watch my 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 presentation yes i can see we need to add in some something or or just just uh, like like the presentation is is or maybe we the, can put something else the con the concept number one um are the yes um let me check maybe, may, maybe we can add um, i need to the concept number one, Anna Cristina sent sen us in the chat. Okay. You you can copy page Jorge. Yes. The chat. Hi yeah. Nelson, who were you working with? Which was your group? Nelson, who were you working with? Nelson? Hello, Nelson? Uh, Nelson, uh, can you hear me? Nelson, me escucha. Criste, me escucha. Hola, hola. No me escuchan. Ah, es que Nelson no tiene la pauta ya de acá. Cristi, ¿me escucha? 
Hola, Tiche. No, te escucha. Sí, pero yo creo que usted no me escucha. Ajá, eh, ahorita la, la acabo de escuchar. Oh. Ok, thank you. Oh, sorry, in the problem, the connection. It's ok, it's ok, no problem. Um, but we're going to bring everybody back. Hola. Hello. Hello, Christy. He tenido problemas para conectarme, teacher, y a veces no, yo creo que no me escuchan. Ok, no worries, no worries, it's ok. Okay. Haga lo mejor que pueda. Gracias. Uh -huh. Okay. Bye, chicos. Um, Ok, I hope, ya le, le di suficiente tiempo para que, um, espero yo, que, que puedan um, haber entendido todos el concepto y poder explicarlo. Más que nada eso es lo que quiero. I need you guys to explain it. So, I'm going to assign you a new group. Um, ok. All right, so... moment okay so in the first group we're gonna have a uh, Christina Annie Carolina and Mari okay in group number two we're gonna have Jorge Linda, Miguel, and Karen. In group number three, we're gonna have Nelson, Nelson A, and Norma, and Omar, and Karina. Group number four will have Olga, eh, Suleima Rodriguez, Chris, eh, Nelson, ¿en qué grupo está usted? Hello. Eh, remember in, in group four, remember? Group four. Okay, good. Y Cristi, usted acaba de entrar. Yes, teacher. No había yeah. My group is four. Four. Mm -hmm. Nos va a hacer falta uno del dos. Bueno, igual. I'll put you in that group. Okay, so let's open the rooms then. I'm going to give you what, what you're going to do is now you are going to have a new group and with your new group, you're going to be explaining the concepts. Okay. So cada uno, es, es, esa dinámica ya la hemos hecho en el pasado, donde los, uh, les asigno diferentes temas, eh, vestía en su grupo, después creamos nuevos grupos donde ya vamos a ir a dar la información de lo que investigamos con el grupo anterior para que en este nuevo grupo tengan toda la información. Does that make sense? Yes? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, so right now everybody should be able to identify what is number one, uh, sorry, the, the mm, the test number one and two and three and four and five and six and seven. That's the idea, okay? So let's open the rooms.
es, bueno, a mí. Sí, ese concepto es a Brown, Brand of Test. Uh -huh. eh, Brand of Test es el marco research tool que help determine consumer preference for one or more alternative or different brands of a product in which the consumer uh, can observe all the characters of the brands. Es una, como tipo una forma de investigaciones de, como de marca, bro. Donde Eh, donde consume is a prefer is a a different brands a según the characters the markers the brands Eh, ¿Alguien más quiere explicar? What happened? I don't know, teacher. Okay, what 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 number are we on right now? Okay. We're doing number one, number two, number three, number four. What number? What is your number, Nelson? Hello. What is the number? That just plain. I don't understand. That. What number is was your group? Ah, okay. I'm ah, sorry. Uh, number four. You were in group number four? Yes. You were explaining um, test number seven? The verdad, I'm sorry, me se me fue la señal en ese momento y se me acabó. La realmente la recarga tuve que ir a hacer otra y ahí fue que creo que tuve problema. Pero recuerdo que era el número cuatro donde estaba. Estaba viendo la, el último, el número 7. Eh, no, estaba viendo es Brown Test y Blind Test. Ah, uh, so you were group number 2 then. Ah, uh, sorry. Number 2. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Eh, okay, so share the ideas for everybody to understand the different ideas. So share, explain as best as you can. Okay, in my case, my group uh, was number one. And we have the test number one, that is sign, sign and handling test. The concept is an A examination is a series of tests that measure a person ocular health and visual status to detect abnormalities in the visual system and to determine, the, determine how well the person can see. Uh, 
we we accord that the concept for the step is this process is in charge of the areas of quality control. They are who approve the product for the sales in the companies. And number two, uh, use the test. Use the test is, um, for example, market research tool that helps determine consumer preference for one or more alternatives or, or different brands of a product and explains uh, maybe this is the performance of the product. For example, in the product is a teacher, you can swear and decide if it's good for you. Hola, Christy. Hola, teacher. Bye. Fíjese que me sacó porque se, como no estoy en mi casa ahorita, voy de camino. Entonces, eh, hubo un lugar donde no llegaba la señal y me sacó del grupo. Ok, no hay problema. Estoy Pero fíjese que yo estoy en el grupo de Linda. De Linda. El grupo. ¿Ah? Segura que no era, no estaba con Nelson, Olga y Silvia, so, es su lema. Es que son los grupos que usted dijo ayer, ¿verdad? No, ahorita hemos hecho nuevo. No. Pero es el grupo 2, eh, tú, usted, ajá. Ah, pues sí, estamos bien, le voy a mandar el grupo 4 porque en el grupo cuarto, 4 va a explicar lo que usted aprendió. Lo que usted investigó. ¿Ok? Pero, pero, de lo que usted dijo ayer. From what you were investigating, yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Entonces yo había investigado otra cosa con, con los del otro grupo. Y yo creo que ellos llevan otro tema. No, 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 no. Ok. Ahorita los he puesto un nuevo grupo para que puedan explicarse mutuamente qué es lo que han aprendido. Ah, lo de ayer lo vamos a explicar entre el grupo nuevo que vamos a estar. Yes. Ah, okay. 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 All right. I'll send you to the new group. Thank you. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. We finished, I think. Really? All of them? You explained all of the the seven mm. tests? And uh, no. Uh, in my case, case, I only explain per comparison test. Okay, but you have to, you have to, like everybody has to pass so you will be able to hear seven, the seven tests. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, in my case, I can... Bueno, lo voy a decir en español porque no sé decir en inglés. 
<risa> Habíamos entendido de que, por ejemplo, a mí me tocó explicar ese, bueno, le explico y ya lo van a saber los otros compañeros que no lo sabían. Entonces, por ejemplo, igual a, a Norma le tocó el brand test y el blind test. Entonces ella lo explicó y ahora ya sabemos eso. Tres, el que me tocó a mí, los dos que le tocó a ella. Y así, eso mm -hmm. hemos entendido. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You, you now have the information of the seven tests. Yes, but now we only have the information of size and hundred tests, brand test, blind test, and pair comparison test. Because I only say one, Omar say one, Norma say two. Only two. Karina, why are you saying one? Because in the group, uh, when you, you say that we only have well, the seven, with, I, know, I, don't, I don't remember the number, but I'm with Mari and with Karen. What were you, what were you investigating? What I investigated okay. about the... What did you investigate? About the per comparison test. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, good. Mm -hmm. All right, and quiero ver Omar. Which this is my group. Uh huh. What 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 was the test that you were talking about? Okay, one moment. Mis, eh, bueno, cuando el día de ayer yo no estuve en clases, pero anteriormente yo estaba en el grupo uno, pero es cuando los empezó a crear. Ah, pero, pero quiero saber, what were you talking about? Ok, yo los investigué todo porque entendí que así era, ahora que conecté. O sea, qué? Eh, the concept is... Uh, Julian Hadley test, uses test, bad test. O sea, todos los. Todos. Yes. Eh, pero es eh, bien. Eh, for example, in number one, to ensure that your product operates as expected the various test method during product. The belief simple it's my my, my opinion mm -hmm. okay 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 um nelson Nelson? Hello. Hi. Hi. And so what, what were you investigating about? The branded, branded test. Only this, I remember. Okay. And only... Blind the, test. It's market research tool to help determine if consumer prefers for one or more alternative or different branch or project. Mm. Okay. You guys are finished, right? Yeah? Okay. All right. I'll see you guys in a moment, okay? In the main room. Okay. Are you guys finished? Yes, yes. Teacher. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'll see you guys in the main room in a moment.
Okay, very good class. Um, so I'm guessing everybody understands it. Yeah, we understand the, the seven different tests. So, so, yes, teacher. What do you not understand? Uh, we don't see all the all the 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 tests. You didn't see all the tests. No. Really? You should have. Yeah. Just one, two, five, six, and seven. Mm -hmm. Three and four. No, because two people uh, have the have the, the the same the same test in the group. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll 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 have to see what we can do about that. Okay, so first, before anything, I need to take attendance because it's past our time. So, um, Christina. Present teacher. Thank you, Annie. Present teacher. Wonderful, Mari. Present. Excellent. Um, Carolina. Present. Excellent, Chris, Christy. Present. Great. Jorge. Present, teacher. Excellent. Um, Karen. Present, teacher. Okay, wonderful. Um, Karina. Present. Excellent. Um, Leonardo. Paso, papa. Leonardo? No? Uh, Linda? Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Uh, Marlene? Marlene? Miguel? Present teacher. Present. Okay, very good. Um, Miguel? Oh, sorry, sorry, I'm being on. Sorry. Uh, Nelson G? Present. Excellent. Nelson A? Present teacher. Excellent. And Norma. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Uh, Omar. Omar. Present. Present. Ah, oh, okay. There is Omar. And Suleima Rodriguez. Present teacher. Suleima Melgar. Suleima Melgar. Okay, and Tatiana. Tatiana? Not oh, Tatiana. Okay, uh, so the people I didn't hear were Leonardo, Marlene, Sulema Melgar, and Tatiana. Okay, all right, great. So let's um, let's <coughs> let's go on to the next part. Okay, so I'm going to share right now this information. Now that we understand the sight and handling test, the use test, print test, blind test, monadic method, sequential monadic method, impaired comparison, let's check this. I want you to match the names of the test with the description, okay? So you're gonna match them as best as you can. And you're gonna do this in pairs with a partner, okay? So are you ready? No teacher, so just take a screen. Mm -hmm. Sure. Okay. Okay. You ready? Yes, teacher. Okay. All right. I'm going to get you to work in pairs. So I'm going to make new groups, or better said, new, yeah, completely new groups, because we're going to have 
we're going to be working in pairs. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's open up the rooms. Okay. Norma. Manda. And number one, this test is good option when there are significant tactile or visual elements, the product of consumer to experience. Experience. I think. Okay. Number one, the steps. Step one. What is the step? What is the step? I think. Uh, mm, one moment, I confuse it with consumer use a product, say, in handle, they, they write. And they use science and handle test. This is yes. Yes. This is, this is number one. This is number one. Yeah, yeah. and number two, uh, use a product, consumer use a product. Mm -hmm. Number two. Yes. Let me see. Okay. And number four is products are tested and branded. So the customer focus is strictly in the product. Brands. And handle one product, then another product, and then another to indicate which do they prefer. Yeah. Consumers use the product in real people. They use the code, cite it, handle it, and then maybe the second. Yes, the second. Okay. Number three, brand test. Consumer take the product to be used either as a sample or for an extended period as they would usually use in their own home. Consumers are aware of the brand. They are trying this test 
pero reflects the real world experience and the value of the brand. Sería number four. The third. In the number four. Which is the concept in the number four? In, in the number three is consumer. Four. Yes. Ah, four. Okay. Consumer are aware of okay. the brand they are trying. Number four is is in the line number four is blind blind test. Blind test, mm -hmm. consumer use a pro sign and handle it there, write it. Mm -hmm. Then they use sign handle another pro and write it. The consumer does not write both pro against each other. This test no. product are test on brand. So the consumer focuses strictly on the product's characteristics and not on the brand name. Blind test. In the last one. I am a birdie. Blind test in the in the last was in the last one maybe number seven. No? Mm, the last one, number four. The number four in the in the seven line. Okay. Product artistic branded. So the consumer focuses mm -hmm. strictly on the product, on the product. characteristics okay. and not on the brand name. Okay. Monaric method. Monaric method. Monaric method. Consumer use a product site, cite it and handle it. If they rate it, then they use site handle another product and rate it. The consumer does not rate both product. Again, against each other. Fair comparison test. I think the number seven is in the line number five. Okay. Fine. Monadic method. Consumers are aware of the brand they are trying. This test no. oh. The number consumer use or site and handle one product, then another and are asked to indicate which of the two they prefer. Which of the two consumer use or site and handle one product, then another and are asked to indicate which of the two they prefer. Maybe the number seven is is in the line number one. What do you think? Eso no lo entiendo mucho. <laughs> Estoy bien perdido. It's it's what okay. What do you have? Uh, 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 we need to to complete with two more.
There's the chair. Okay, do your best guess. And we're gonna check together as a class, okay? Do your best. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Are you finished? Yes, teacher. Okay. Wonderful. See you guys in the main room in a moment. Okay. You guys finished? Yes, teacher, finish. All right. See you. Yes, miss. Okay. Okay, how did you do? Are we finished? We understand it. We're completely lost. Yes, I'm finished. Yeah, you finished? Yeah? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna be checking the answers. Um, just give me a, one second. One second. Okay. Um, okay. I'm going to share. Tell me if you can see it. Can you guys see? Yes, teacher. Perfect. Okay. So let's start with the first one. Sight and handling test. What is that? And you can open your microphone. Me, teacher. Okay. All right. Go ahead, Carolina. What is sight and no. handling test? Okay. Number one, sight and handling test. Is this test a this is a good option when there are significant tactile or visual uh, element of the product for consumer to experience? Excellent, very good, very good, Carolina. So number one is this one, right? Sight and handling test. So basically, this is where you are able to manipulate like you can touch tactile is touching right so you can touch you can visualize something that because sight comes from from seeing right okay and handling from from touching okay all right does that sound good sound good yeah okay good omar do you want to help us out with number two or yes Yes, teacher. Wonderful. Go for it. Use this. Uh, consumer take the product to be used. Enter is a sample for 
or for an extended period, period or as the world usually uses in their own home. Excellent, very good, very, very good. So this is where the customer takes the product home, they start using it in their everyday life to like, you know, for a period of time and um, they see if it works. Yeah, they, they like the product. Okay, sounds good. Yeah, it's clear. Yes, teacher. Wonderful. Okay, let's go on to number three. Who wants to help us with number three? Branded test. Okay, go for it, um, Cristina. Brand test. Customer are aware of the brand. They are trying this better reflect the real world experience and the value of the brand. Very good, excellent. Okay, uh, so. In, in this one, we are testing the brand names. So you're not you're not just te testing a product, you're testing the brand name. You're, you're seeing if people like the brand. Okay, the brand is the name of the of the product. Okay. All right. And like it says here, it reflects the more the real world experience. Okay. Um, and what they're testing is is the the brand important are people are people um a, are people influenced by the brand okay so far so good we understand one two and three if you don't understand something let me know oh Okay. It's okay. Okay. Sure. okay. Okay. Very good. Let's go on to number four then. Blind test. Who wants to help us with the blind test? Uh, teacher, maybe it's blind test products are test on brand. So the consumer focuses strictly on the product's characteristics and not on the brand name. Thank you, exactly. Blind, blind the ciego, right? So you don't know what brand you are using. So you cannot know if you like the brand or you don't like the brand, that's not important. What's important is uh, the quality of the product. The characteristics. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay, the characteristics. Characteristics. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. So we don't care what the product, what the product name is, right? It could be, uh, you know, it could be a very expensive product, like I'm sorry, a very expensive brand or a very cheap brand. It doesn't matter. What's important is what characteristics do does this product have that makes it good? Okay. All right. Let's go to number five, mon monadic method. Hey, teacher. Okay, go for it, Carolina. Monadic method is consumer use the product in real circumstances. They use a product, size, it, handle it, and write it later. Excellent, very good. This is similar. This is similar to the use test, okay? Where you take it home and use it. The difference is be, uh, specifically that this one, it's not that you don't, you don't take it home, right? You just use it in real life circumstances, okay? Um, and you're able to, you know, see it, touch it. And at the end, after using it, you rate it. So, 
it, it, this is the monadic method is very common. Um, sometimes you may see this uh, like places like um, a, a um, shopping mall. They'll have people that they, they, you, can, you can test the thing in that moment, right? That's where the difference between the use test and the monadic method is. Because um, the use test, you take it home, you use it for a period of time. But in the case of um, the monadic method, you, you see in that moment and you rate it, you decide what, what is, if it's good or bad in that moment. Whereas the use test, you, um, you do it many, many late times later. Okay, like, um, yeah. Okay, does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, great. Let's go on to number six, sequ sequential monadic method. So if you understand the monadic method, the other one should be quite easy. Uh-huh, okay. Sequential monadic method is consumer use of products, say, say it and handle it, they write it, then they just say, handle another product and write, it the consumer does not write both product against each other. Excellent, very good. So basically, the same thing with monadic method, except that this one is like okay, I test the product, I decide if I like it, I finish, I rate it, and now another one comes. That's basically the difference between the monadic method and the sequential method, uh, monadic method. So we just we just continue doing one after another and after another and after another, okay? And you do not, the products are not tested against each other. You, you test them separately. So you use one, you touch it, you smell it, you use it, you rate it, and then, okay, that's finished. Now, new one. That's the, sequ the sequential monadic method. Is that pretty clear? Pretty clear. Pretty clear. Right. Yes, thank you. Yeah? Okay. Uh, okay, let's go now to number seven, paired comparison test. This one's the most difficult one. What is it? By elimination, teacher, is the line number one. <laughs> yeah. Tell me what it is then. Uh, pair comparison test, consumer use, or site and handle one product, then another and are asked to indicate which one of, which of the two they prefer. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> so this one, Similar to the sequential monadic method, you have to test more than one product. But in this case, you have to, you are comparing them, okay? You're saying, oh, I like this one more than this one because of this reason, okay? I don't know if you've ever had um, a test like where you, um, for example, they, they may ask you to try two different drinks, like, to give an example, uh, Pepsi and Coca-Cola, but you don't know which one is Pepsi and which one is Coca-Cola. And you just have to decide which one you like more. Yeah, that's kind of like, it's very similar to the paired comparison test. So you have to say, ah, I like more this one or I like more this one. Okay. 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 All right. Great. Okay. So now that we understand this, okay, we're going to do this. Okay. So it says there, work in small groups, 
retake the new product idea your group presented in unit one. Discuss two testing strategies to fit the characteristics of the product. Brainstorm the advantages of testing the product using the strategies the group, the group have selected. Decide on the best strategy to test the new product. Present your analysis to the class. ¿Se acuerdan que hicimos uh, hace algunos días atrás? Hicimos uno donde teníamos que identificar que un producto que queríamos, un producto o un servicio que queríamos lanzar. Do you remember that? Yes, teacher. Ok, good. So the now we should... Huh? The product line. Yeah, no, no, sorry. No, 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 no. not the product no. line. You, it's, it's, it, was a, it was a product or a service you wanted to, to make. Mm. Yeah? Okay. Okay, and you wanted to launch it. So we're going to go back to the same groups. This time, you, what you're going to do is you're going to think about two testing strategies that you can use to test the product. Decide which one is better to use uh, depending on the, 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 the product, right? Okay, and then you're gonna tell your partner, your, your class, the class why, um, sorry, which one you have chosen and why. Is that clear? Yeah. Yes or no? No teacher, for please repeat. Okay, so you are in your group, you have, you have chosen a product, right? Yeah? yeah. Ya, ya tienen un producto, ¿verdad? Ya pensaron en yeah. el producto porque eso lo hicieron la vez pasada. Right? Yeah. Yes. yes. Dígame yes. sí o no, ¿por qué? Yes, teacher. I, I don't remember my product, teacher. Okay, well. Super selectos. Well, no, 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 no. That was the product. No. That was the product line. No, estoy hablando del servicio que ustedes decidieron cuál cuál mm -hmm. iban a hacer. ¿Se acuerdan? ¿Se acuerdan que ustedes eh, eh, hicieron el SWOT? Eh, sí, teacher. Sí, hizo de, de, de la, la propiedad Diana. Uh -huh. Perdón. ¿Se acuerdan? Strength, yes. weaknesses, opportunities, the threats. Entonces, sí. eh, de, eh, lo lo ¿Cómo se llama? Hicieron el, el SWAT o el, el FODA, que en español, y después uh -huh. decidieron, ah, si es una buena opción o no es una buena opción. ¿Se acuerdan? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay, so now you have a product or you have a service. Now you're going to decide which strategy, or what testing from these ones, I'm sorry, which one? Side and handling test, use test, brand test, blind test, monadic method, sequential monadic method, paired um, comparison test. Which one of those seven do you think would be the best for your product or service? Okay? Okay, teacher. Yeah? Could you repeat the last part, chair, please? you're going to identify which test is better for your service or product. Okay, thank you. Yeah? Okay. Sounds good? Yes. Okay, good. All right, so I'm going to put you back into your groups. Mm, solo que me van a tener paciencia mientras encuentro ahí donde lo habían hecho. O si ustedes se acuerdan, sería aún mucho mejor. Do you remember who was with you with the SWOT analysis? My group. 
Eh, Olga. Ok, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Va, un momentito. Okay, so, sorry, eh, bye. Otra vez, in your group, who is Olga, who else? Miguel, Tatiana. Miguel y Tatiana. Me. And yes. you, of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Tatiana is not here. So we're just going to have Karen, Miguel, and Olga. Yes. Are okay? Yeah. Eh, si, ¿se acuerdan que estaban en este mismo grupo? Sí, teacher. Okay, good. All right. Yeah. Va. Um, ¿Alguien más que se acuerde con quién estuvo en ese grupo? Nadie se acuerda. ¿Se acuerda que les dije? Acuérdense de este grupo, uh -huh. porque este grupo lo vamos a seguir utilizando. Y es este, eh, el... Ajá, todo, uh -huh. con todo el. ¿Se acuerdan? Les dije, en todo el curso vamos a estar utilizando ese mismo grupo, así que se, acuérdense. ¿No se acuerdan no acuerda de nada? Yo creo que yo sí. Ok, que yo, re, yo remember con me. Norma. Ok. Con Norma, creo, y con Jorge. Uh -huh. Ok, Carolina, you are with Norma and Jorge. Es mm. número one, teacher. Es ah. Jorge. Había alguien más, teacher, pero no ah. recuerdo quién es. Había yeah, alguien más. Sí, es, I'm sorry. Es, eh, Yo tengo también en grupo Carolina, Jorge, Omar. Carolina, Jorge y Omar. Y Omar, yes. Y Norma. Y Norma, Norma también. Norma. Norma. Bueno, sí, vamos. porque Norma hizo la presentación, por eso recuerdo. Ok. Ah, ok. Va. Ok, perfecto. ¿Alguien más que se acuerde? Es que puedo ir a buscarlo, pero, pero ahorita si se acuerdan es mucho más fácil. No, no se acuerdan. Ok. Va, hoy sí les voy a pedir que siempre se acuerden porque vamos a seguir utilizando este grupo. Ok, eh, so let me just... Va, dame un momentito. Carolina, Jorge, Norma, Omar, Norma. Entonces Carolina, Jorge... Norma Omar. Teacher, creo que fue el 16 de marzo. 16 de marzo. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. El día siguiente no tuvimos clase. Uh -huh. Algo así. Watching the video. ¿Mm? Ok, va, ya lo tengo. Ok, so, Carolina, Jorge, Nelson. Nelson, quiero ver cuál Nelson es. Nelson G. Nelson G. Uh -huh. Nelson G, Norma y Omar. Ahí está. Con Karen estaba... Ay, qué raro, no me parece Karen. Ah, sí, 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 con, perdón. Con Karen estaba... Um, Miquel, Olga y Tatiana, sí, correcto, pero no Tatiana está. Ok, vamos al próximo. Eh, 
Cristina Karina. Nelson A. y Suleima Rodríguez. Okay. Um, Ani, Mari. Eh, Cristina, oh no, sorry, Cristi. Y Leonardo. Sí, sí, Leonardo, en el que no están. Ok. Eh, Ana Cristina creo que no estaba ese día. Y Linda creo que tampoco. Entonces la voy a meter en el grupo 4. Ok, a las dos la voy a meter en el grupo 4. Ok, va. Hoy sí, chicos, acuérdense sus grupos. Ok, esto lo vamos a ir reciclando. Ok, so, do we understand the instructions? Yes, yes? ok. Yes. All right, I'm opening the, the rooms right now. Por porque tal y ah okay okay uh -huh. is my case ahorita en serio Porque no deja tener la ropa de cama, por Hola. Pero nos dijeron que nos iban a poner con grupo que el que habíamos estado. Yo no estuve con la niña Cristina. Estuve con Cristina. <risa> Ah, pues, ah, pues quizás nos, nos dividieron. No, usted estuvo. Yo estuve con Cristina, Leonardo, María. Y eso no te he No veo con, con quién tengo yo aquí. Que... Usted me acaba de mencionar a ellos cuando me mencionó en el grupo. Vaya, eh, Ani, usted estuvo con Leonardo, eh, Mari, Ajá, okay. um, Cristi y Leonardo, pero como ellos no están, ah, okay. entonces eh, le he puesto ahí con las chicas que no estuvieron ese día. Ah, ok, ok. Understand. I understand. Okay. Ok, thank you, teacher. Right. You're welcome. Entonces, <laughs> tenemos que usar esto. Hello, teacher. I, I think I'm not with in this group. I don't remember any person of this. Well, you were. No, I, I remember you're about, you're talking about the group uh, in the fourth, I don't know, the pronunciation. Uh-huh. 
I know I'm with Carolina, creo. And Nelson, and I don't remember who else. This is this is what I have. Ajá, pero ese es para en ese grupo que estuve con Ana Cristina, Nelson y Silvia fue para el de las líneas de productos. Sí. Sí, en el del SWOT estoy con otras personas. Ok. Entonces me dieron información correcta. Va, pero. Okay. Entonces voy a. Va, lo voy a regresar al, gru al grupo entonces. Ajá, eh, si quiere, yo digo el, el producto que elegimos para que así se acuerden los que van conmigo. Va, ok. Bye, chicos. Muy sí, probablemente sí. ustedes me se están preguntando por qué me lo saqué tan rápido. Y resulta que estábamos dándonos cuenta que no es el grupo indicado. Eh, porque es el grupo del product line. Entonces, el del SWOT. Tiene que ser este. Se los voy a mostrar. Porque ahorita ya, ya, ya estamos al final de la clase. Así que no, no tiene sentido que les voy a mandar. Pero para mañana ustedes eh, lo miran y me dicen. ¿Ok? ¿En qué grupo? De... Eso es lo que yo tengo. ¿Ok? El grupo 4 muy probablemente habían más... Uh, personas, pero en ese momento que tomé la captura de imagen, se habían salido por X o Y motivo y entonces solo quedaron dos, pero eh, Mari y bueno, Mari es la única de este grupo que estaba, que, que está ahorita no sé con, si usted se acuerda Mari, con quién estaba I don't remember teacher, sorry What was your product? No sí me acuerdo teacher Teacher, ¿de qué fecha es eso? Eso es de un día anterior, eh, un, eh, o sea, eso es de un día después, perdón. El viernes pasado. El viernes. Teacher. Pero es que el viernes tuve. ¿En Teacher. qué grupo me voy a poner? Uh -huh. eh, ese, eso fue de un día después que usted eligió los grupos. Eh, sí, teacher. Al final, Final se empezó solo, solamente con 10 participantes, entonces usted no tuvo otra opción que, que, que comenzar a hacer eso, exacto. Ah, Por eso entonces, es que no estuvimos todos como quienes habíamos hecho el grupo el día miércoles, porque no, no todos estaban. No, es que es el sub, es de la página 16 de lo que está hablando la teacher. Este es otro grupo, es, este es, otro grupo. Uh -huh. este es el grupo donde hicieron el producto. Eh, bye. Por ejemplo, bye. Cari, uh, um, Carolina, Karen, Karina, uh -huh. son, eh, ¿ustedes se acuerdan que, que, cuál fue por su producto? Yeah. No. Para que no remember. Teacher, yeah. I, I remember. Teacher. Uh, ok, pero un momento. Ah, vino. Teacher. El vino. Un momento. Yes. Vale. Ah. Eh, primero solamente el grupo 1. Carolina, Karen, Karina y Nelson. ¿Se acuerdan ustedes cuál es el sí, grupo? Teacher. 
¿Cuál? En el vino, vino. El vino. No, okay. sí, solo teacher, son? perdón. Sí, teacher, perdón. Lo que pasa es que cuando usted nos dijo, guarden los nombres porque este va a ser eterno, que este grupo va a ser el suyo siempre, Ajá. fue el día miércoles. Le digo esto porque mi grupo, el que yo le mencioné ahorita y con el que estuve discutiendo, hicimos un grupo de WhatsApp afuera del, de la clase por lo mismo. Porque Ajá. fue cuando usted nos dijo, ese grupo es eterno, de aquí hasta que termine el módulo, ustedes van a trabajar juntos sí. siempre. Por eso ah, es okay, que okay. le decimos Perdón, que... entonces, entonces fue mi culpa. Yo, yo me equivoqué. Este es el grupo en que, en, que, que tienen que, que estar um, trabajando. Ah, okay. uh -huh. Ok, porque vamos a hacer, porque la, la idea es de que con este grupo vamos a seguir la secuencia ahí del producto. Ya creo, okay. o sea, creamos la idea del producto, ahora vamos a ir con métodos de, de, de pruebas y, y seguimos aprendiendo más acerca de los otros pasos. Ok. Bueno, ok, la verdad que también quizás sí tiene razón la compañera, en este grupo no los había dicho usted que lo guardáramos, fue el anterior. Pero entonces vamos a seguir con ese, con sí, este último. Con este. Correcto. Okay. 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 Thank you. Ok, va. Hoy sí. Guarden ahí sus nombres. No sé, como le digo, lastimosamente creo que en ese momento tal vez se me salieron algunas personas y no pude ver quién estaba en el grupo 4. Todos. Eh, me imagino que también habían otros que tal vez de otros grupos que se salieron porque. Sí, ajá, de parecer. Pero El bueno. Siguiente no tuvimos clases no, ese fue, ese fue el viernes teacher, yo no aparezco en ningún grupo sí, muy probablemente o no estuvo el viernes o se salió no, no el estuvo. momento no, no estuvo el viernes eso fue, eso fue. pero está, está en nuestro grupo con Karen no, pero ya no oh, okay. sí, uh, ya, no, ya a... no Miguel ya no. vale. Entonces, el lunes vale. vamos a, a seguir ahí entonces con ese grupo, ¿ok? ¿Con, Ustedes, cuál, ah, con, con el que les acabo de mostrar. Ah, ok. ¿Okay? Tómenlo en cuenta y el lunes entonces me dicen, ya solo me dicen, sí, yo estoy con culado, me dado y sutano. Póngalo otra vez, por favor. Póngalo otra vez. Ya los voy a ubicar. Pero ahorita solamente con los que aparecemos y después ahí nos resolvemos. ¿Ok? Ok. 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 Va. Ok, guys. So I'm just going to take attendance quickly before, before anything finishes. Um, Cristina. Present teacher. Okay, good. Um, Annie? Present teacher. Good, Mari? Present. Carolina? Present. Christine, eh, sorry, Christy? Present teacher. Jorge? Present teacher. Karen? Present teacher. Karina? Present. Leonardo? Leonardo? Ok. Uh, por cierto, eh, le tocaría a Leonardo el día de hoy. No sé si alguien quisiera tomar su lugar y quisiera hacer el, el, el uno a uno, de la sesión de uno a uno. ¿Alguien? Ok. Bueno, piénsenlo mientras termino. Eh, Linda. Presente. Eh, Marlene. Marlene. Eh, Miguel, Present. Nelson, Jim, I hear Miss. Good, Nelson A. Present teacher. Norma. Present teacher. Olga. Present teacher. Omar. Present. Suleima. Suleima Rodríguez. Present Rosa. teacher. Okay. Suleima Melgar. Y Tatiana. Bye. Ok, solamente recordarles, les voy a recordar um, cómo está para la próxima semana. El lunes le tocaría Linda, martes Marlene, miércoles Miguel, jueves Nelson, G y, y viernes 
Nelson A. ¿Ok? Para que lo tomen en cuenta y si quieren reprogramar para otro día, podemos hacer cambios. ¿Ok? All right, guys, take care. Have a wonderful weekend. Enjoy yourself and I'll see you on Monday. Thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye-bye.